Hello everybody, Jose Rodriguez once again. We're back inside of QImage Ultimate and we're gonna cover another feature. One of the ones that everybody seems to be looking for because basically you folks, as well as I, don't print as often as we should be printing. And so we need some way to exercise our printers while we are not printing. And there's nothing better at this point than the unclog tool inside of QImage Ultimate to access that all you have to do is go over to the file tab and then scroll down to where it says print schedule unclog job perch sheets we'll go ahead and click on that and you'll get this very nice little window here you can go ahead and read that on your own but basically what it is going to allow you to do is to create a custom purge sheet normally found to be just a band of yellow magenta cyan black and in the case of printers that have more sophisticated ink sets you will have also the light magenta light cyan included as well as grays and sometimes even red green blue or orange ink so in order to be able to use this and by the way you can schedule it to whatever suits you in other words, if you're going to be away for, say, two weeks, you can set it to print one of these purge sheets every two days, for instance. And when you get home, you will find that indeed it did print that. Now, there are some caveats that you need to adhere to. That means that you have to have QImage open and you have to have the scheduling tool also activated and left open. So you go away, you better not have a power failure. You would have to have some sort of backup system installed in order for the printer to be able to continue to print these scheduled purge sheets so right now what i have is my top four printers a pro 1000 pro 100 pro 10 and the pro 1 set at a schedule and basically they will print a custom created purge sheet let me go over to the pro 10 it should be the same pro 1000 however notice it has blue included so in order to create one of these let's go ahead and create a brand new one we're going to hit the plus little icon right here and that will allow us to then search for one of our printers and we're going to go ahead and choose say the p800 now the p800 simply has a nine color ink palette is the k3 type ultra chrome ink set which contains just your normal colors no red no blue no green just your normal color set and a set of gray inks so we're going to go ahead and just have it print on regular letter size paper so we'll go ahead and locate that letter size and we're going to be using the sheet feeder in other words the top most feeder and one thing that you need to do for this to really work well is to print without color management okay for some reason that allows the channels to print as much as they can i mean only a rip a raster image processor can actually print magenta only from the magenta channel regular drivers cannot do that so but in order to get at least you know 90 percent of magenta channel printing magenta you have to choose off no color adjustment and what we're going to do is we're going to choose quality as well and we're going to then set it for a glossy paper or any kind of luster or whatever you need to do that because you want it to print at the highest resolution that will not be available if you just choose plain paper now we are actually going to print on plain paper because of course we don't want to waste our good photo paper simply for doing purge sheets and so that's all you have to do set it in other words tell the printer to make believe that is using a fine photo paper highest resolution no color management but just use your plain common copy paper or plain paper and that is about it we're going to go ahead and okay and okay as well now we have to create the set of colors that we wanted to print with so basically we do not need red because the p800 does not utilize red nor blue it does however have black and gray magenta yellow and cyan so that basically is it now all we have to do is schedule it and we can set it for the same schedule that i've been using two days and at 
10 p.m. at night, okay? And it will then begin to print on July the 2nd, which is today. And so tonight, this printer will print a perch sheet. Now let's take a look at the perch sheet and how it actually looks. So we're going to go ahead and queue it up because I want to go ahead and do one manually right now. So this is what it looks like. Let me go ahead and enlarge this a little bit. As you can see, it has wide bands and then a series of varying widths and also densities. This has been engineered by QImage to be the most effective way to exercise your nozzles. These patterns are not there haphazardly. They are there because this has been decided and determined to be the best design to exercise your printers. That is it, folks. That's all you have to do, okay? When you schedule her, make sure that this little clock right here is turned on, okay? So we're going to go ahead and turn that. Are you sure you want to begin unattended printing on clock jobs starting today at 10 o'clock p.m.? Yes. And so now all we have to do is minimize this or leave it open. It really doesn't matter. And you are free to go on your two-week vacation or whether it is 10 days or just a week. It will continue printing every other day at 10 o'clock or whatever time you determine is the best time for you. And when you come back, you will have a happy printer. Now, keep in mind, this is not a nozzle check, okay? This is simply a custom created purge sheet, basically matching your color palette of your particular printer, whether it uses your regular CMYK or CMYK red, green, blue, orange, whatever. It will allow you to create a custom purge sheet. Again, the design is the most effective way to really, really, truly exercise your nozzles while you are away enjoying your vacation. It will continue to print those sheets. Just make sure you have sufficient amount of paper loaded. Make sure that the paper is nice and crisp and not bent or, or you know, dog-eared or it might jam the printer and you get home and you have a big jam waiting for you to welcome you. So, yeah, just, just keep that in mind. Make sure that everything is just fine. Print something just before you leave and then go ahead and leave it alone. Leave it on and when you come back. Assuming, of course, no storms went through and knocked out your power, you will have a series of perch sheets. You can look at them from beginning to end to see if there was any changes in the rendition of this particular perch image that you have created. All right, thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed this. Again, one of the many awesome features that QImage Ultimate offers. Nothing to do with photo printing. This is one of those things where it just simply helps you maintain your printer's health. All right. Don't forget to subscribe, share, and like. And until the next time, as always, happy printing, everyone. Bye-bye.